James Corden has had to abandon plans for a new pool house during a rebuild of his £8.5 million home because the development was deemed to be too close to a Neolithic monument. The megalithic structure in question is also controversial and is the subject of a repatriation wrangle between the UK and the Crown Dependency of Jersey. The Mont de la Ville Dolmen was first discovered on the island in the 18th century and given as a gift to the then Jersey governor Henry Seymour Conway in 1788. The military man was responsible for constructing a number of round towers to defend Jersey from French invasion. Field Marshal Conway had the dolmen transported to his estate in Henley-on-Thames, where it was re-erected and remains to this day. Corden acquired the dolmen when he bought Templecombe House in Berkshire in 2020. He is expected to move to the site when he returns to the UK after his stint on the Late Late Show in the US. The TV star was granted planning permission to demolish the old home and pool house and construct a new six-bedroom house after a planning meeting of the local Wokingham Borough Council, but documents revealed he had originally wanted the development to include other features, including an indoor and outdoor pool, a sauna and steam room. But the scheme was only green-lit once these aspects of the plan had been dropped. In his report, planning official Simon Taylor said, following discussions with the applicant's agent, it has been agreed that these aspects of the scheme would be deleted from the current application to allow the application to proceed to planning committee for determination. It is possible that the pool house and outdoor swimming pool will come forward in a future planning application to be considered at that time. English Heritage deemed the pool house to be too close to the collection of 45 megaliths that form a circle in the historic Grade 2 listed grounds. The original country house was built in 1869 and it is believed to have been a boarding school from 1948 until it was demolished and replaced with the current house in 1961. Mr Taylor said the planned pool house by Cordham was originally reduced in size and relocated further north due to the harm to the setting of the Druids Temple before being dropped entirely. Heritage chiefs in Jersey recently launched a bid to return the stones to the island. A petition to the island's government read, With the proposed new developments to Fort Regent, now is the perfect time for the government to approach the UK and the now owner of this sacred Jersey dolmen and work with them to bring it back to the island and reinstate it on top of Le Mans de la Ville, where it so rightfully belongs. So what do you think? Should James Corden get his pool house? Should the dolmen be returned to Jersey? Let me know in the comments below and don't forget to like, share and most importantly subscribe. And you can also support the channel on Subscribestar via the link in the description. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.